5th Battalion, Royal Sussex Regiment, Wikipedia article audio. The 5th Battalion, Royal Sussex Regiment, was an infantry battalion of the British Army. The battalion was part of the Royal Sussex Regiment and existed from 1908 until 1966 when it was disbanded. The 5th Battalion, Royal Sussex Regiment was raised at Middle Street in Hastings on April 1, 1908 upon the creation of the Territorial Force, formed by the amalgamation of the Volunteer Force and the Yeomanry. The 5th Battalion was mobilized in August 1914, immediately upon the outbreak of World War I. The 1-5th Battalion was assigned to the 2nd Brigade, which included the regular 2nd Royal Sussex, 1st Division from February to August 1915. On August 20 it transferred to the 48th Division as the Pioneer Battalion of the Division, serving on the Western Front. The 2-5th Battalion was raised at Hastings in November 1914 from the Home Service Men of the 1-5th Battalion. The battalion was mobilized on September 1, 1939, and was initially employed guarding vulnerable points in Sussex. It then moved to Dorset to carry out heavy training for deployment overseas. The HQ wing seems to have been sent to Katistock, with the other companies at Toller, Melbury and Iverschet. Here they joined with the 2nd and 4th Battalions to form the 133rd Infantry Brigade of the 44th Infantry Division. On April 3, 1940, the battalion left Katistock for Southampton and was then shipped to Cherbourg on the night of the 8-9 April on board SS Amsterdam. The battalion was made up of 29 officers and 690 other ranks. During the night of the 9-10 April the BN was then moved on to Vivoyne, and did some final training. The BN then moved to Bellews, and then after two days marched to Street. Paul, with the HQ being set up at Quantville, Somm, with the other companies at Epps, Podcalais and Hestrels. On May 11th they then move on to Lillers to perform L or C duties also listed as guard duties. The unit then moved on to Vichtrup Pedagon via motor transport to take up defensive duties. After arrival they were told to march back 17 miles into France. Then after marching all night were ordered to turn round again and head straight back to where they had come from, so marched 35 miles in 24 hours. On May 20 they moved on to Wurdegem to take up defensive duties covering the river Skelt, with trenches on the forward slopes. The battalion started combat on May 20 when they came under shell and mortar fire. On the 22nd the BN retreated to Coutre, and then on the 23rd to hospital for incurables at Street. Andre. 160 casualties were reported here. On May 24 the battalion was sent to Villar Berquin, and on the 25th to Strasil where they encountered German tanks and took heavy fire. On the 25th-26th they moved on to Rouge Croy, taking a defensive position facing Hazebrouck, then pulled back to Montecats. On the 27th they come under heavy fire from dive bombers and shells. Finally, on the 28th they retreated via Poppering to Braydunes from where they were eventually evacuated. The battalion, along with the Brigade and 44th Division, were evacuated to England. They spent the next two years on home defense and preparing for the German invasion of England, Operation Sea Lion, which never arrived. In the spring and summer of 1939 the Territorial Army was ordered to be doubled in size by the duplication of existing units to form a second line, on a similar basis as in the First World War. As such, the 5th Royal Sussex formed a duplicate unit, to be known as the 7th Battalion, Royal Sussex Regiment which came into existence in June 1939, when the 5th Battalion was almost double its normal strength. The 7th Battalion was commanded by Lt. Col. Argethon, with headquarters at Brighton. The 7th Battalion was assigned to 37th Infantry Brigade, alongside 5th Buff 6th Royal Sussex, part of 12th Infantry Division, 